the watching the play and, and hearing the words and seeing ourselves on, like our images there and like somebody speaking our words was very powerful. It was very powerful. This project is a multimedia uh, documentary based dance performance, uh, which is dealing with the topic of the drawdown of the Western military forces from Afghanistan after 13 years of combat mission. We are using interview material, which is spoken word on stage. We are using contemporary dance, because our choreographer Yasha was also there during the research in Afghanistan. And then we're having the media like audio and video. And this is what we do. It's a two-hour performance. And we have, in the original piece, 15 people involved. And uh, here it's a little bit more even. I'm an American Studies major, so I guess right now I'm really interested in the relationship between America and the Middle East and the wars there. But I'm also a dancer, so it was really exciting for me to see those two interests collide in this. You buy into that. You buy into that othering of, of people. And, you know, it's powerful. War is a very ultimate reality of our times in both of our countries. So I think it's important that the arts also keep up the discourse. Yeah, I guess it's sort of a way to start a conversation about how do you talk about war? How do we frame war? And it's important that it's physical and it's dance because so much of war is about, you know, your assault on your physical person. At one part of the show, they kept like going off stage and like running and falling on the floor and then going off stage and running and falling on the floor. And I thought that's like, those that are just questions that we just kept cycling through our minds like all the time. Like, why are we doing here? What are we doing here? What is this happening? And then people kept falling. So I felt like it was just like a moment uh, that a lot of people didn't understand the audience. I, I got that. <laughs> but uh, but certainly that played into the mind, uh, that played into my mind and another veteran that went there. We talked about it afterwards. And I said it burned because uh, lots of women, even my in my family, my cousin burned herself. And uh, this is one of the mm, Things that I this use. is one of the things I use in my songs because women in Afghanistan, they're not human beings, they're just slave beings. Like art is subjective and, and you could interpret how you want to interpret. And I feel like art was the best way of doing it because um, there's no right or wrong. Uh, there's no yes to, yes we win, yes we can evacuate, yes we can change, or no we can't do that. Um, and I, and I feel like it's harder to agree to disagree when it's about these kind of topics. But like it's, it's not hard to disagree with watching uh, art and, and seeing dance. Um, so I, I loved it.